welcome to a new episode. This one is going to be special. Like life uh, finds a way, uh, this is a 100 uh, sub special. Uh, this episode is special because uh, those are not my products. This is uh, one of the subscribers, his products, and he offered me that uh, if I want I can do a review and that was like, wow, amazing. So big thanks to him. And yeah, I was thinking for a couple of weeks what I could do in the, for the 100 subs and I think this is a perfect one. So thank you and have fun. So this one is going to be a little bit different because I'm not going to trash the boxes or stamp on them or uh, throw them uh, around because they are not mine. And I bought with me a gift for him afterwards. Uh, it's a Star Wars knife or so on. So I hope he will like it. But yeah, now let's see what's the first item. Let's take the camera a little bit better. We have some manuals this time and we're not going to throw them away like always. B brushless one. S yeah. You can feel the new uh, smell of the drill. Interesting, there's... oh yeah, this is uh, nice, it's also... Oh, it's so nice to see a new drill. This is a better model than I have. Seems it's the last for one from the shop. Oh, nice to see here. At the end of the video, I'll post uh, an update on how the tools work because I'm not going to test them myself. I'll let the owner test those tools out, but they look nice. So, Malkita gives a cheap bit with it, one charger. Uh, I already know why he bought the uh, drill is because uh, he uses uh, 14 volt uh, Makita tools and he says that uh, the tools are really great but there's one 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 more small uh, downside and the downside is the torque level of the 14 volts so he's now migrating to 18 volts and I can see for myself the lawnmower that I would love to buy myself, but at the moment I can't afford it. So, oh, oh so nice. Oh, yeah. Again, the manual. Bag. Okay. Oh, it's heavier than I thought. Is it all on camera? Yeah. This thing is heavy. 
What is there one? Okay. I always wanted to see the blades. The blade is quite tiny in my mind. It's not sharp. interesting I was looking down here and there's no way the grass can go anywhere but in reality if you open this up you can pull this off and now the grass will go backwards before this it just lays around it's all protected that's nice no way to get stones or anything else in the way uh, now What did you uh, think uh, when somebody comes to your house and puts something together? So smooth. Still, my first guess was right. This goes this way. Here and here. Interesting, it has two uh, holes. But, I don't know.
full. Oh, this is nice. A vent hole of some sort. Oh, this is nice. If the back gets full, this will open up like this. So you know when the bag is full. This is a nice feature. Look at the manual. Okay, there's a key. Here that is missing. So, yeah, this was the last one in the uh, shop, as far as I know. And I think this was. Uh, uh, used as a example in the store and yeah the key is missing so I'm going to give the sad news uh, and maybe we can uh, do a makeshift key by ourselves so there's the sad news uh, the the sun is quite hot, so my phone overheated and de deleted the video I did, but I'm doing a second review. I already unpacked it, put it all together, give it my opinion, but now let's do the, this again in a fast way. Manuals, not thrown away, because it's not mine, it's a subscriber's one. Two batteries, they are nice because the smell with, with noodles and the trill. It's a brushless one. It's much heavier than mine and it's a higher torque level so this tool will last a bit and uh, I think the owner will have fun with this one building his house. And uh, one charger with the foot. Uh, and this is an extra piece from Makita, a uh, drill uh, starting bit. I'm looking at the camera if it's ro still rolling. <laughs> yeah! But now... The owner of the devices, the subscriber, uh, told me that he will uh, let me mow a little bit so I can g get the impression. There was a complication with this uh, mounting this device and as it was the last one in the shop the package was pre-opened and the key was missing 
so we um, did a makeshift ski for here just a uh, standard uh, uh, metal strip that we put uh, instead of the key to get it working but uh, this thing has a nice feature uh, I previously that you didn't see talked about and this is this so if you take the back side off uh, it's uh, It's uh, go, uh, it, uh, the blades don't uh, go out from the both sides, and the machine is quite heavy. And it works like a charm, no problem there. So let's see how. The makeshift. Wow, this is hot. I think we need to make a new key because this one is so hot. So, from the downside, I'll take the batteries off because uh, we don't have the original key in. So, from the downside, the blade is uh, small. But the inter interesting part is uh, this piece is plastic. But uh, later uh, in the evening I will come back and ask the owner what he thinks of uh, this device and how it works. But as an extra piece, so you're not that disappointed. Sadly that this video didn't came out like I wanted, but life is life. So and for the sub I brought the knife for a present. And he also told me that he bought this metabo. Uh, this is for water systems. And this will be like an extra piece. What we got here? I just love unboxing new stuff. It's so fulfilling. I don't know why, but but unboxing stuff is fun. Smell of new. Wow. Nice paint job. A cage. And wow, Metaboy even gives you tape. That's nice. I hate this tape, but. It's nice. So I'm sorry that the video didn't come out as I wanted, but you never know. Now I'll show you my current setup of the yeah. Here you can sh see how I used a piece of cardboard to hide the phone from the sun <laughs> because yeah it's so hot but yeah the Makita is really nice and here's the missing piece and we used uh, 
clip here but uh, the clip needs because this was missing uh, this is the key and the clip gets so hot that uh, it doesn't work so all the voltage will go through this and it needs to be bigger so we are going to fix that and sadly I can't show you how we do it because uh, the owner doesn't want uh, me to show his home but that's not the problem so See you in a bit where we can see how stuff works. Now we made a new key. Here you can see it. And let's see how this baby works. Oh, yeah. <laughs> One fun part is that there is no oil and gas, so you can always tilt it <laughs> and there is no leakage. But yeah, we will be back later tonight and see how this baby worked and what's the... So it will have a little bit of work, a lot of work, so we will know the battery drainage and everything else. Uh, what more? Uh, I wanted to thank you, thank the sub subscriber who let me unpack it. S sadly, I uh, lost one video, but life is life, so stay tuned and see you in a bit. So, now it's evening. The lawnmower has got some work behind it. This works perfectly. If it's uh, empty, it's open. If it gets full, it closes up. So nice uh, little feature. And down you can see it has had some works, work to do. Here's the grass. And that's not the right one, but you get the point. <laughs> and the verdict is this machine is super supreme. The only the downside is that he told me, too small, get the bigger one, but excellent machine, works like a charm and it's quiet. So stay safe and be happy. I wanted to end the video here and what else, uh, the subscriber told me like I said, he's really happy with the device, works like a charm, no problems. He only regret is that he didn't take the bigger machine. Uh, the blade, his concern was that uh, if he buys the bigger machine, the motor is the same and it may struggle with his yard because it's not the most perfect and uh, now he thinks that there wouldn't have been any problems. Yeah, wanted to get that out of the way. And the drill, also much more power than the old uh, uh, 40 volts <coughs> series that he had. On my side, uh, I'm a little bit disappointed that I lost the video of the unboxing and my impressions and so on. It took me around, I looked at the time that I arrived and when I discovered that my camera was overheated, uh, I lost around 1.5 to 2 hours of footage. So, yeah, it happens. but. I can't get it anyway back, so what can we do? But on my side, really, I'm grateful for all you 100 subscribers. And I never asked uh, any of my friends, you must subscribe. Uh, some of my friends asked, oh, you have a YouTube channel, do you want that I su subscribe? I said, do as you like. 
I want only legitimate people who watch it and have some knowledge from it or just have a laugh at me. Whatever. What's your point is? But I want that you subscribe if you really want it. Mm, I don't want anyone here to be just a placeholder. So, my gratitude and uh, thank you. Uh, I suppressed, suppressed my, uh, su su uh, surpassed my expe uh, expectations because I thought that maybe on the end year, uh, this year's end, I will uh, get to 100, but come on halfway uh, till the year and already 100 so thank you uh, it's really nice to see that uh, people really enjoy it I started this channel out as uh, not to get any subscribers but just to get a video vlog of my doings for myself and People start, uh, started liking it and yeah, here we are. So, thank you and the next uh, milestone is 500. Maybe we reach it. I'm going to set it for the next year's end. So, uh, 2021 is now. So, 2022. Uh, 2023 maybe we reach 500 so let's see that's my expectation but i think we are going to reach it before this but now i need to record my next video because i got some materials that i was uh trying to fight for the last month or so but now i did it so stay safe don't get covid and have fun! It's summer, at least here.